Hello, we're off on an adventure today. We've gone to Nonnington. Didn't want to go too far because I've got the little noddy car. Um, it's my little passenger. He's all ready to go already. Just going to go up there, have a little shoot around with the camera, show you a bit of insight really, and uh, just crack on from there and see what we see. All right. Yeah, so like I say, we're in Nonnington today. Um, nice quiet place really, there's not a lot of things that go on around here. Um, a little bit of woodland, a little bit of field for him to run around. We did do a shoot with Wilfred here earlier in the year, um, which was amazing. Um, but it does take us forever to get up to the field though, because Kobe wants to sniff everything up the path before we get there. So it does take us a little while. Look at that, even the trees here now. Beautiful, that's just the main path. To the main field. There is, if you can see it, a little rabbit over here. Yeah, it's just there. I don't know if you can see that. A little rabbit. So, I've got to be a little bit careful with Kovu because uh, he'll think that's the best dog toy toy ever if I let him off. So, I've got the long line for him. We'll just keep him close for a minute and see uh, see how we get on. Typical British fashion. Raining now, as always. Um, we're going to go up towards this tree line. Can you see it? Orange tree line in the over there. Um, so hopefully it won't matter too much to us. Hopefully, like I say, you can never really tell what the lighting's going to be like from one day to the next at the moment. But you can find spots and make there is and make good photos really from anything. But we're just going to go up there, have a look, and, and uh, we'll meet you there. <laughs> Do you mean about the weather? Look, it's got just to the other side of the field now and the sun's decided it's coming out. So you just got to keep an eye on the camera settings really. Um, what has he found? I don't know what he's chewing. Let's have a look. Have you? Oh, turnips, a bit like him. Little tree line here, I like the look of that. We'll uh, give that a go. Um, have you come? set the dog up. I am on my own today. Usually I'd have uh, Kachina with me and she would usually be with us on a normal shoot. Um, she can't be here today. Um, but generally I say even if she's not and have the owner with us, have yourself with us, uh, um, does help setting you up. So it might be a bit mismuddled today trying to uh, get Kovu all set up for this. So uh, we'll see how it goes. Kovu, watch me. Okay, come in. Good boy. to the deep dark woods. Now this here looks like a nice natural frame that goes around. I like that. I'd like it to be a bit orange really, a bit autumnly. Um, but let's give that a go, see what that goes like. Toby, come here. Good lad. Oops, sit. Good boy. Wait. Now when you're going into the woods, keep your eyes open because there's going to be little bits and pieces you can take pictures on all the way around. So we're always looking around. So if you are talking to us and we're on a shoot and we're looking around, we aren't ignoring you. Um, we're just distracted. We're just looking out and seeing what we can find really. Um, I like the idea of this here. This camera on camera here doesn't really pick it up. But on my main camera and when, in real life, you can see uh, there's a beam of sunlight coming through here. Wait. Wait. This is something to look for as well. You see this path here with the colours either side? That for composition for photography, that's a nice, lovely leading line that we can use. So I'm going to set Cove up on the top of here and show you what it would look like. Head down. Head down. Good boy. Good boy, wait. Wait. Vinewood. 
into the next one. Look at that. I mean, even if you're just coming for a walk, it is lovely around here. I do love it. Um, a lot of greenery around here as well. Um, a lot of photographers will shy away from green. I don't really know why it's quite trendy to make everything quite orange and magnetic at the moment. Um, but if you have black dog or you have uh, dark reds or red colours, so it's just keeping um, a bit of colour theory really. The opposites do make a really nice photo. It will work really nicely. So um, just have a play about really. That's what it's about. I'm a big fan of long dead grass. It's a lovely colour really to work with. I'm going to set cover up and we're going to get an action shot. We'll try and get an action shot. Obviously I'm one handed today so um, I'm not really sure if we'll get it or not. Let's have a go. around if you're still there um you're quite new to this vlogging thing you can tell we're probably seeing the confidence as we've gone on got a bit better obviously being there behind the camera it's the reason we're behind the camera um but yeah thank you and if i'm shouting at you i do apologize i went to a gig last night first live music for about three years because of covid um so i'm a little bit deaf this morning so branch here i'm not going to get covid to climb it because it's been a bit slippery and i don't want to hurt him obviously we wouldn't put your dogs in danger as well welfare um we'll only do what they're comfortable with COVID, come here come on one two three four five good boy so i'm going to set him up just to do a pause up i think Ooh. come here pause up pause up pause up <laughs> he thinks he's going to do wait there wait Wait. Wait. Good boy, coming in. Now we're going to attempt a portrait. Obviously, I'm on my own, so I'm using the tripod. Don't know how it's going to go. Obviously, when you're there, I'll be taking the pictures, and you'll be uh, you'll be behind you'll be behind in front of the lens. Sorry, um, let's give it a go. I know it's a little overhang with the bush there, so I'm going to get Kovu underneath that, and we'll take a picture there. So. We're going to call it a day there. Um, got some nice photos I think I'm going to link them up to the stories so when you see where we are you can see the pictures we've taken hopefully um, a typical session would be about an hour long for a photo shoot um, obviously if your dog takes a little bit to warm up um, they're not very confident obviously it's a strange man strange camera they're not used to seeing that every day so fair enough if it goes over it's not a massive problem so it's not, not an issue as long as we get the photos we want um, so yeah get booking thanks for watching um, and we'll go on a nice walk together take some photos for your house thank you Say bye then, Kovu. Wave. Bye. Good boy.